I have nothing left to bet, you idiot. The plane. <laughs> That's rich. <laughs> oh, why the hell not? I've got you beaten anyway. Oh, yeah. What have you got? Hmm? <laughs> Wipe your mouth, Blackburn. That wasn't supposed to happen. But you know, I'll be taking that plane anyway. What the bloody hell? You lost, I beat you. Mm. The thing is, Rackham, it's a very beautiful aeroplane, and you're kind of a jackass. I beat you fair and square, goddammit! Stay the hell away from my kind! <laughs> oh, you bastard! You can't do this to me! I beat you! I beat you! My name's Clyde Blackburn. I'm a pilot and a gambler. I'm George Rackham! I'm George Bloody Rackham! Listen to me! You bastard! Keep off my air! If you asked me to name my biggest fault, I'd have to tell you. I'm just not a very honest person. Welcome aboard! I'm Wilson, by the way. You must be George Rackham. Sure, I'm Rackham. I'm your guy. Come on. Let's get this kite up in the air. You're George Rackham, son of the 4th Earl of Windsor. That's right. Hip, hip, go, the Bristol was everything it was advertised to be. A pure joy to fly. It was a crisp, sunny day, and everything would have been perfect had I only been alone. Don't you think? Right, you see that plane up ahead? You need to catch up with it! Yeah, yeah! So listen, I know this little French place, maybe we pick up a couple of girls... What are you talking about? Girls! This is a test flight! You need to follow the route that plane is setting for you! Okay, you're the boss, apparently.
exactly by the book. So toss the damn book and live a little. Where's he going now? Leave him. See those target balloons? Weapons check. Fire at will. I can do that.
Wilson. Prepare to be left in awe. The bird was busted. She buried her nose in no man's land a half mile due west of where I went down. Wilson, the poor sap, didn't make it out. But that was his bad luck. I had more pressing problems. Ist das kalt? Halt endlich dein Maul!
I'm just gonna say I've had plenty of practice moving quietly. Out the back of bars, bedroom windows, you don't need the details. Anyway, once those Germans were gone, I put my skills to work, heading west towards the British front, quiet as an alley cat. Between me and the British front were German trenches and German guns. Oh, and half the population of Berlin, all spoiling for a fight. Lucky day. The Brits must have been sitting down for tea and crumpets instead of shelling the Germans. Still, I had to get through to our side of the line before those guns started up again. Rede mit einem, den dein Geschwätz. Those trenches were packed full of the Kaiser's finest, but hopefully, most of them would be looking for trouble coming the other way. Hopefully.
A dozen German machine guns at my back kind of encouraged me to keep my head down. No Man's Land was a maze of barbed wire, dead bodies, and debris. But I held my course. Did anything survive the crash that might be useful? George Rackham, are you? Son of the fourth bloody Earl of Windsor. <laughs> I'm not even you think I am. Oh. Uh, let's get out of here. time to get him back alive.
Simpson said I was a no good, lying son of a bitch. I brought him home because I think he's probably right. And I hate that fact more than I can tell you. This guy's a bloody hero. No, he's nothing of the sort. He's a cheat, a thief, and a liar. And he'll answer for his crimes. That's right, Blackbird. 